welcome back to my channel if you want to know how to get your hair to look like this keep watching and we just gonna get straight into the video look at me bald head scallywag yes this week is from Ossily hair I order from them all the time this is like my fourth time ordering from them and this time I feel like I got a bad batch because usually I get bum HD lace but this lace seemed more of transparent, but I can work with it. I do have a big head, so I do have to cut my wig, so I wasn't too mad about that. But back to the video, that's what we're here for. I cut the tabs a little, you know, to get it in line with my hairline. To make it easier for me to cut because I have to make my own hairline. I'm going in with my Erica J Watermelon Scent Lace Glue. I need some more glue. I forgot to catch up Black Friday sale, but I will order some more soon. And I think I did about three layers, but I only showed y'all me doing two layers because, you know, Y'all, I actually filmed this video a month ago, but I forgot to edit it and post it because your girl been busy. Y'all know I'm in nursing school. I've been busy, y'all. So I'm giving it to y'all now. Now that I laid the lace down, I'm blow drying it. First, I'm blow drying it on cool setting, and then I'll do a heat setting. Then I'm applying my elastic band. I love this band because instead of me having a tie, it just struck. Look at that milk. Now let's cut the lace. Y'all, I swear this lace looks so transparent to me. So for the front part, I had to part it out so that it can match my hairline because if I didn't, it would have been too far on my forehead and I don't want that. Now I'm using my Ruby Kisses foundation in the shade 15. That's a shade darker than me, you know, so that it'll blend. But this lace acting like it ain't gonna blend, but y'all see it. Now I'm gonna try to do my infamous curve part. 
Every time I do a side part, I gotta do a curve part. I can't just do it straight because it wouldn't look right. Now let's hot comb it to get this hair flat, baby. Flat. Now I'm applying foam to the top of my head so it can lay flat and get rid of some of the flyaways. Now I'm going to part out my baby hairs. Here I had to cut more of the lace off because you know it was excess lace. Going in with my wax stick, this is the holy grail to a flat install. Now I'm going in with my black even spray, you know, to make it melt melt before I put the band back on. Going back in with my blow dryer, first on a cool setting and then on a heat setting. Then I'm going in with my pantyhose, stocking hose, whatever y'all call them. Because I seen on TikTok that the girls was using this to melt the lace. Baby, yes. But I went in with my elastic band on top because I needed my lace melty for real. Just in case that didn't work.
Now I'm going in to thin out my baby hairs. I accidentally over plucked where my part at, but I can fix it. Now I'm going to use a razor comb to cut my baby hairs because I feel like it's better than the scissors. Now I'm using my small pink flat iron that I had for years. They work just as well as that mini flat iron that everybody done bought from Amazon. Yeah. To lay my baby hairs, I use Nairobi foam, my favorite. When you're doing baby hairs, you gotta take your time, man. You can't just rush on this. You have to take your time. Now this baby hair was giving me a hard time because it kept looking like it was so thick and I'm pretty sure that I plucked it so I just kept, went back in to pluck it. Now I'm going in with my spray on dye to fix up my part. I use dark brown instead of black because black will show.
And I'm going back in with my makeup. Going in with my spritz for a seamless install. I went in and added a few tracks to the front of my head to make it look a little fuller. And now I'm using a razor comb to try to do layers. Well, attempt, and it didn't work out. Now I'm using my one curler to curl my hair and put pins in it to try to, you know, pin curl it so the curls won't fall. Look at that. Yeah, we just gotta trust the process. Now I'm going in with the hot comb to comb the curls out a little because they are too tight. I like my curls loose. See, like that is so cute. It's so cute. Now I'm gonna put a braid in my hair because I was invest a trend right now. Well, they do fishtail braids, but I didn't feel like doing a fishtail braid. I did it eventually, but not right that second. As you can see, I started to feel myself and started making TikToks and videos on Instagram that I didn't do a proper outro. So here I go. This will be my outro. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Bye.